What's happening, people? Today we are here with Pokemon Solar Light and Lunar Dark, and we're gonna oops, and we're gonna continue our adventure throughout the region. So let's get to it. Right now, I don't have much company in the house, and even when I do get company, I will try and upload as much as possible, even though it will be embarrassing as hell to talk like this while well, I have people around my house. Wow, I like Critter. I didn't think I'll be finding you here. You're, you're, you're an electric type, but... I'm going to uh, see about capturing you. Actually, I can tackle you. I'll stab Bubbles, so this pound should be weaker. Yes, perfect. And here we go. I'm also going to do the Pokedex completion quest on this game if I can. With commentary. I'm going to try to do a lot of edits with it and make us look cool. The Lady Critter is a very agile Pokemon. They store up electric, uh, sack electricity in their fur as they run, which is pleased, release it when irritated or frightened. It's a frisky Pokemon. I'm not sure if I... I don't know. I wanted to use my original team I had previously to this. And that involves an electric-type Pokemon. But, I don't know. We'll see. I'm also going to catch you. Just to get you in the Pokedex and out of my hair. Do we get XP for capturing Pokemon right? We should. That's kind of like a, a staple now. Oh, yes. There we go. This one is a favorite pet because of their soft and fur and gentle nature. It has been said that touching the star on the back of a hamstar will bring you good luck. Alright. Oops. Fuck. Hit my mic. Okay, there we go. I shouldn't be cussing. Um. Because honestly, this isn't recommended for... That would just mean this isn't recommended for children, and this also would mean this game itself and... How I'm talking just isn't recommended for young adults either. So let me just do my thing. I'll sit up. I'll watch my language. I'll watch my profanity. While Bud Sheep are usually rather quiet, they start loudly ch chattering should they sense any danger. They are commonly kept as both pets in natural alarm systems. Oh wow. Here we are. My heal. I actually want to deposit these Pokemon. Ah, uh, we caught three already. I'm also gonna get some Pokeballs. There you go. I will not be using you guys, so... Welcome! Alright, here we go. Pokeballs. Oh, we also have some quests. I get an extra... F uh, five. So we have five in total. Do you have anything to sell, actually? Nope. If we do, I will keep it in mind. I just wanted to know. So, we have quests here. I love the hat. Hey, I'm a new trainer. You too? I walked you through Route 1, and then I saw this beautiful girl. I don't have the courage to talk to her. But I wrote her a letter. Can you bring the letter to this girl? Oh, thank you so much. You're a coward. Are you serious? You can't even confess your feelings to her. How much do you really love her, brother? It's like, honestly, honestly, she's such a girl. Were you a girl yourself? Why you gotta be so shy about it? Hello there. Will you like a trainer? Aren't you? Wait, you're a trainer, aren't you? I need someone who can... Do me a really important favor. My wife is feeling really bad. By oh, the, that's right, her. I can't call our family doctor from Serpentine City. It seems he has mis he has mislaid his phone, and I'm too weak to go through Mossy Forest to ask him face to face. Too weak? What you mean? Could you go to Zaffronite City and tell him that we really need his help? The fuck? Uh. <laughs> Thank you so much. I hope you can uh, find him as soon as possible. I actually have to keep my phone on because I do have the door locked in case anybody tries to knock on it, they can call me. So, yeah. 
So let's go ahead and talk to this girl. We also have to go to the... Oh, wait a second. Uh, I just forgot what that guy just said because I was reading my text message. <laughs> Ongoing. The love letter, tell the doctor. Amiya needs a doctor for his sick wife, but isn't able to call one. Find a doctor in Serpentine City and tell him. Okay, so I have to tell the doctor about him and his wife for them he can check up on her. And after that, I have to, uh... Oh, what's that? A letter from a boy who saw me on this route? Ah, that's so cute. Wait a second while I read it. Wait a second while I read it. <laughs> oh, he wants to meet me in the Bookmaster in Monster Town? Thank you so much, I have to go. Are you serious? I would have him come over here, are you serious? I think I caught all the Pokemon that are in this grass, so we're good. We leveled up six two times, so we're good. I said six for some reason. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the lady right there. We've been inside every building. We talked to you, didn't we? Yeah, okay. Alright, talked to him. He said he wants to get a Pokemon and shit. Like, at least I can say that word. I can't say the F word. Or, uh, what other words? Or you use multiple profanities in one sentence. Sorry to get in the way, but I should. I found some strange footprints, so I'm just examining. He's still examining? What else do I have to do? Oh, that's right! Don't tell me I have to. Wait a second, what am I doing here? <gasps> no! Don't tell me! He already left, though. What do I have to speak to her? I must have to, she's still in here. Finally, I'm both packed in and ready to go. Oh, hi, Cole. You have something for me? Cool, a Pokedex. This will come in handy. I do wish it was pink, though. Oh, that's true. They do sell po pink Pokedexes back at Diamond Pro. Anyways, are you going to uh, take on the gyms as well? Ronnie stopped it by, uh, uh, stopped it by on his way to Serpentine City, and he told me about it, so I think I'll take on the gyms as well. It'll be fun. So since you're here, how about Pokemon Bell? Not here, though. I just cleared, cleaned in my room this morning. I'll wait for you outside in the front of the entrance to Monsey Forest. Then we can bow. <laughs> you clean your room even though you're gonna be hanging out of here? Clean... rooms. Yeah, my room's pretty decent. The floor definitely needs to be swept though. I wish I could buy one of those uh, automatic... Those little... Automatic vacuum cleaners that just go around clean your house for you. It's like they're like droids of some sort. Alright, let's do this, Cole. This is my first train battle, so please don't be so rough. Oh, she has her own theme, too? It sounds a little fitting. Pearl it! What does that sound? You sound like an electric type. And you lose. Goodbye. Oh, you got a crit, though. We're both the same level, though. Jeez. I need to step up my game. Oh, not anymore. Oh! I'm over to level 9. Now it's awesome. You're gonna be so strong. Here, let me heal your Pokemon. Oh, thank you. I think I should get more potions or antidotes. Well, I'm going to head through Mossy Forest now. I hope I find cute Pokemon in there to catch. See you later, Cole. Mmm... The Pokemon I just caught, I don't know, they don't look promising. I know what Pokemon are the best in this game, so I'm not gonna rely on those. There is so many Pokemon in this game. You guys have no idea. This is not even 1% of all the Pokemon that are in here. Uh, Professor Pinewood's PC. Cole's PC. Uh, no, I don't want to go to my PC. I was gonna, I was gonna buy stuff. <laughs> Welcome. Oh, sorry, I also have to collect my reward. Um... Yes, I want to get antidotes. I'm going to get three of those. Let's be rational with our money. Potions, let's grab two. And we have enough Pokeballs, so we're good. Thank you so much. I never thought the girl li the girl liked me, but she came. I have a gift for your effort. A rare candy, not bad. I am almost level 9, so I'm not going to use it. So I have to talk to him still. 
I'll try and remember that. I'm going to explore the entire city once I head, head there. So ultimately, I will talk to him. And this, you're gonna give me something for waiting so long? I look at the footprints. It turns out they were my own. Typical, typical. Oh, wait a second. You got some fresh water for me? Welcome to Mossy Forest. That's your job, just greeting people as they come in and out? Be careful in the forest. It's easy to get lost. Although it's not black and white, where you can look at this from a different angle. Well, obviously, this isn't 3D, but I thought it would tell me something. I would like to know some information on whatever happens here. Mossy Forest. We do have three rivals in total in this game, so I'm not sure if I'm going to see him in this forest or once I beat the first gym layer. But I believe it is at the first gym layer because it happened in the previous demo. So we're going to figure that out. And there's our first point you're about. Turns out they have their own theme. We did get the exclusive moves asset to hit grass types with. So suck my balls. Level 9. Well, you're almost level 10 as well. So no we're candy. We're halfway there. We don't have headbutts. I'll check the upper part of the north side of the forest layer. Oh, you're just a different color. I thought you were the same. Okay. How easily is it to take you down? That will never work because I am uh, a special attacker. No, I'm not. At Cell Ad is not a special attacker. It's actually a physical. Or at least his evolution line is. It's actually a mixed attacker, but mostly physical. As well as his move book. Um, I'm just gonna level up here with the level 10 and then use the rare candy. Because I will be relying on Saladnid for a while. I don't need to worry about any other Pokemon that come into my party. I'll use an experience share to level them up. And we should be level 10. This way, I will not be overpowered too easily. I should just wait before, so I get the real, um, get to the limits of how much I can level up here. I probably should just take on all these trainers and then level up. Mm. All right. That way, I'm taking care of the low levels, taking care of my. Um, I don't know, how does it really work? If I give myself more XP... No, if I level myself up, I'll be getting less XP for leveling up again. Because I'm at a higher level. And a higher level means I get... Less XP for a lower level Pokemon. But from lower level... And I get XP... I'm leveling up more because I'm getting... Because I'm at a lower level. Because I'm facing things with lower level... I... have a lower level. So I'm getting more XP for that Pokemon. But then once I use my rare candy... I, okay, I really don't know how the... This, I don't know. This is a weird logic. Do I get more even though I'm, I'm weaker? Or do I get... Or like, I don't know. What's, what's, what's better? Are you grass? Yes, you are. But I still kill you. That one was cool. Oh, what? <laughs> Do I have to, oh, that's right. I also want to get trains on my Poke Gear, so that way I can actually level up my Pokemon more from a from a uh, phone call by rematching them. All right, Smet, which means that we battle. Yes, indeed. I like that hat, that blue white hat. If I, if I can find a hat like that, I do find a pretty cool hat at Slay Eleven. This is my party hat. Water support? I can use that. Maybe. But it's only good against fire types. I mean, any, it gets any fire type at this level. I'm already, uh... I ultimately already won, but whatever. Hope you guys can't hear those creaks in my chair. It's, uh... Yeah, those are pretty annoying. I'm trying to be still if I can. Uh, that just means I need to get a new share. Obviously. Oh, Lavin Seed. 
This one's actually a little rare, not too rare. I wonder, can Bubble keep you alive? It is resistant. Quirklet. I guess we'll never know. That Pokemon is actually a quite rare in this forest from w the last demo. So killing it like that was honestly unfortunate. I'm at two completely higher levels than these Pokemon. That's crazy. They actually put a lot more animation into this game too. That's great. Because they really put a lot of hard work into this game. I'm not sure how many creators were involved into this game. I know there was a lot. But as the main developers, I just wonder like how much work did they put in comparison to the others. Who also contributed to this game. This game did take them years and years. Um, from the last demo. So I don't really know. Pixwee. You are adorable, but no thank you. Retreat! Retreat! Stick it. <laughs> Wait a second, hold up, are you serious? Stick it. Oh, wow. I think they'll actually have a name like that on Pokemon. I mean, it's not anything uh, it's, uh, provocative, but whatever. Provocative? Is that the right term? Yeah. Anyways, you look small and puny. I think that should be easy. Are you serious? I don't know how I'm supposed to attack it again. Won't a bubble kill it? I don't know this Pokemon's stats by heart. Uh... Yes, okay. There are so many Pokemon in this game. There's no way I can keep track of all of them. I don't think anyone knows every single Pokemon in this game entirely. I shouldn't be saying that, but it's most likely yes, because that is... That's not... That's like... That's probably an understatement, honestly. There's too many Pokemon in this game. I love it. This is why this is probably my like second most favorite fan game. I think my most favorite is Insurance because it's just I love the intensity and all the mega evolutions and stuff. Lemon Seed spends most of their day basking in the sunlight for necessary nutrition. They are attracted to kind people, though large crowds may scare them away. Oops. Let me fix that. Oops. Come on. I really need to buy a desk. I spent about $20, almost 30 on damn glasses. Uh, because uh, I look at monitors and TV screens too much. Yeah, I have been getting a little blind from it. And having trouble sleep, so... I wanted to do that. And then once I had enough money, I was going to... Uh, buy me a new desk. I really need a new desk. Luckily, I think I'm going to be able to save and have enough money by the next two weeks and buy one. I seriously cannot take this. Whoops, I keep knocking my mic. <laughs> this won't be happening if, if I didn't have this dumb setup. Dude, look at me. I'm using my own dressers as my setup right now. It's terrible. My mouse and keyboard can't even go on this desk completely. I mean, it's not a bad setup at all, it's just... I don't know. It just isn't the best. I want everything to be where it is. I kind of have this table right here as a stand for my mic, and it's just terrible. Not as a stand for my mic. Uh, I forgot what this thing is. It's like, basically those arms that... Oh wow, you look cool. Oh, I already know you. They're pretty rare. I can't actually get you unless I get it from my other train, don't can't I? Play fight? What is that? That's new. And this train is actually really uncomfortable. Not only is it creaks a lot, 
is uncomfortable. I can't afford another one at the moment. I should have went for a potion right there. That was a terrible move. Oh, but it did two damage. Okay, we're good. So, Fart, you're down. Alright, use the rare candy anyway. And the dope. I think I'm sick. So, we're gonna check out the rest of the forest. Let me get my bag and get a potion. We have plenty of potions, so we're good. I would like to heal up full, but I don't know if there's any more trainers here. I'm gonna check the north part of this forest. And see what's up. I also want to see if there's more Pokemon in this grass, because I do want to catch every Pokemon in the game. Because that's honestly why I love about this game the most, is that there's just, just so many Pokemon. Otherwise, this game will be very generic for me. Because this game has been generic so far. It has been lovely. I love this game. I loved that first and everything. When I first started playing, it was such a beautiful experience. But, um... Yes, yeah, so as you can see from the dialogue and so far, what's going been going on and throughout the story, or just starting up the uh, starting up the game, it has been new a little. There has been some minor details that are new from previous Pokemon games. I'm not trying to be judgmental. It's just that there's a lot of fan games out there, and in comparison to all of them, I have to like tell which one's the best from greatest to worst. And so, this one's this game is really amazing. And what makes it stands out from most fan games is that there are so many Pokemon implemented into it, and I love that because there's so much creativity between it. And I just love all these Pokemon in this game. There's Pokemon in here that I love more than the original Pokemon. But the problem with it all is that, um, besides that. It's a little generic in terms of like story and adventure. And Pokemon Insurgents has an adventure and story, no doubt. That's what makes that game stand out. But anyways, sheep people travel in large flocks. Sometimes they are such large amounts of such large amounts of them together that when resting, they make they make they make can make entire rock faces look covered in grass they make can make <laughs> entire rock faces look covered in grass what okay well, but okay I guess they can make rocks look like they have moss all over them that's basically what it's saying I mean, there's such large groups of them I don't I don't think they would like you know reside on rocks to make it look like moss I would think they'd be on trees of some sort but uh, yeah Anyways, what I was saying, this game has a lot implemented into it. From, but what implements it differently from other games is that th there is a lot of Pokemon in it, lots of Pokemon, and I love all of them to death. Honestly, I love the creativity in this game. Um, but Pokemon Surgeons has a lot more Pokemon, a uh, lot more story and background with it that make it exciting. So when people are playing that game. They're looking into the story as well, some uh, some people of which, and they really in love it. And critics rave about that. And when critics rave about that, it gets people wanting to play it more. And so that's what other people did. And for my surgeons, there is not, there isn't their own type of, um, there isn't like, you know, new original Pokemon. There's just reskins sometimes. Or just uh, new Mega Evolutions. And that's all cool. Everyone loves Mega Evolutions, even though people complain about them. Uh, competitive player players complain about Mega Evolutions, but in my opinion, they're they're revolutionary into the meta game. I mean, into Pokemon. So I don't understand why people will complain about it. But uh, Mega Evolutions, Delta Pokemon, great story. This is also rich and awesome to the game. There was so much going down. And I guess people, even though they weren't playing the game, they just felt that there was a lot going on and a lot of adventure to it. So, even when I was a kid playing Pokemon Diamond and Pearl, I didn't know what was going on. But I feel like there was a lot of importance in the story of what's happening. I felt the, um, I felt the story of it. I read it and I didn't know it because I was too young to read it, but I knew there was a lot going on. So, this is a gateway. It connects two areas. Make sure you rest them. 
rest there. So yes, I felt it all. I knew there was a lot going down. I knew the game <clears throat> was uh, very interesting. And and I why why I started playing is because I heard a lot of people talking about it. And Pokemon Diamond Pearl actually has a good backstory. Sort of. Actually, it does. Kind of does. But, um, anyways, yes, the game is very interesting. Pokemon Surgeons. The Pokemon Sword of Light is very great because they have somebody put one in it. The story isn't that bad. There's a lot of things to seek out in this game and explore. This is what makes a Pokemon game a Pokemon game. This is a definition of a Pokemon game. Um, it's just, it's just very generic. And that doesn't really stand out from other games. So, yeah, honestly. Great game, though. The thing I love about Pokemon Centers is the fact that they cost nothing. If you and your Pokemon need a quick rest, just come to Pokemon Center. But yes, I do love this Pokemon game because I if, any, if there's anything in Pokemon that I love the most, it's the Pokemon themselves. And I love that more than anything. Uh, the story can be crap as long as there's a lot of Pokemon to uh, discover and complete, I mean, uh, capture and use against other trainers and battle with them and all that stuff. Uh, the story, that definitely needs to be in there, otherwise I'll get bored. But it isn't a big necessity, in my opinion. That's my opinion. So yeah. Anyways, it's a great game still, nonetheless. <laughs> but I love it. So I have no... My criticism is that this game is great. It's just, it, it's just that, yes, anyone would agree, almost agree with me that the story is a little generic, but I love it. Maybe the story will be different in this new full version, maybe they twisted it, but we'll have to see. Hello, I'm here because I lost my three kids. They are running around the city, but I can't find them anymore. Do you search for them? Yes, I can. I just want to see if my pop filter's on my mic, right? Thank you so much. I hope you can find them. And you? I'm looking for Larvin Seed. Oh, Larvency for a monkey. Okay. Hello, my name is Password Pat. I have a very special gift in my bag, but you can only get them if you tell me the correct password. I don't have the password. We are gonna have to search that up. Oh wait, Larvency, I already have it. This is my party. I was like, hmm, okay, you need Lavency. I'm gonna have to go get one out of my PC, but wait a second. Hold up. I have a right in my party. Oh, Monkey, you look different. Cold Trey Eleven Seed for Monkey. So there we have it. You're a lonely nature, that is terrible. You're a special attacker. Uh, you have the simple ability, which is terrible. Trick shot? The user distracts the target, then shoots them with this small with small rocks or other pellets. You distract them and then you throw pellets at them. So, is a priority because of that? Or... I'm not sure how it really works. What's this, what does the distract mean? In its uh, reference, I just don't understand. Does that mean... Does it work like... Um, follow me? I'm gonna put you inside here because I... I don't know. I have my party planned out. I will try and use Monkey later. Or at least I will try to evolve him once I get Moonstone. So I'll do that. Um, for now, you can stay in here. So we need to find kids, find the uh, doctor, and we... Oh, there's Rodney. Hey Cole, you made it. You catch any cool Pokemon? Wait, don't tell me. I want to see them in battle. But first, I think we should check this place out on my right. It's a trainer school. Do you think you might learn something cool if you go in? There's only one way to find out. Come on. Trainer school. Let's have a talk with the teacher now. Come on. Why, hello there, young trainers. My name is Devin Bella. But you just call me Mr. Bella. That sounds like a woman's name. I'm the teacher at this uh, my trainer school. I teach tra beginner trainers things they will need to know to become the best trainer they can. Now, bouncing on my experience as the former gym leader of the city, which my dar has now taken over. Whoa, your dar is the gym leader here? Gym leader here? 
Yes, indeed. I taught her everything she knows about being a gym leader. She's still new to it all, but I think she's finding her feet. Awesome. Cole, this will be easy. I wouldn't be too confident about that young one. She may be new at being a gym leader, but she is quite experienced in being a trainer. You definitely have, ha you definitely have an intense battle, a intense battle ahead of you. Hey, you know what? Let's make a deal, Kira. If you beat her in battle and show me the badge, I'll give you something special. I won't tell you what it is, but it's something very useful for trainers. Doesn't sound too hard. You're on, Mr. Bella. Come on, Cole. Let's go to the gym. There's nothing you can teach me I don't already know. I'm gonna go to the gym right away. I want that gym badge. I'm gonna have to explore. Let's see here. Oh, it's 30 minutes. Ah. Well, we're gonna have to put it down on this episode, people. Thank you guys for watching. And we will, we will be back to take on the gym here. So, yeah. Peace.